hi guys welcome back to my channel journey to health with seals now today guys we're going to be talking about an important recipe for rapid hair growth now if you want a recipe that will moisturize your hair and also keep your hair growing guys i have the secret recipe for you it's going to be rosemary water now guys this rosemary water was made from rosemary from my garden. I'm gonna take you outside and you can see how easy it is, guys, to grow rosemary in your garden. But also, with its amazing benefits to our hair, it strengthens our hair and also, it allows our hair to grow rapidly, guys. There's also one secret ingredient that I include in my rosemary water and I'm also gonna share that with you. It allows our hair, myself and my daughters, here to grow so strong strong and so healthy guys i've been using this rosemary water since i i braided my hair and look at the rapid growth i have incurred just over a few weeks of growth this is approximately two and a half inches of growth guys you see how rapid my hair has grown and this is only a few weeks of growth now guys i want to invite you to come along with me I'm gonna share with you the best way to make rosemary water or rosemary spritz as some people call it and you are going to experience rapid hair growth using this various treatment so come on over let me show you how now guys I'm taking you outside in my garden to see what my rosemary plant looks like I only have one small pot actually I have two pots of rosemary here and all you have to do guys is when you go to the store you pick up your rosemary okay as you can see this is what it is and this is the fresh rosemary and all I had to do was to go to the Home Depot or you can go to Lowe's or anywhere Walmart anywhere that sells plants and you can just pick up your rosemary and all you have to do is to you know pot you get a pot this is a cloth pot I get them on Amazon okay purchase my cloth pot on Amazon and I can also include this in the description box where I purchase it and all you have to do guys is to you know get some soil some potting soil and I just put your rosemary in and you can have rosemary all summer long so guys if you're gonna be making you know a full bottle of rosemary you really don't need a lot okay so I'm just gonna take one you know one stalk of my rosemary here and that's all I'm gonna need that's all I'm gonna need then I'm just gonna use my scissors to slit it here okay so I have already cut my rosemary as you can see nice big branch of rosemary there and I'm gonna take it out I'm gonna take it inside and I'm gonna uh, use this to make my rosemary water for hair growth. Now guys, I've harvested my fresh rosemary from my garden, but you can also get this from any Walmart store, or if you have a supermarket near you, you can also get your fresh rosemary, or you can purchase dried rosemary, whichever rosemary you have. You can actually use it to make your oil for your hair. So I'm gonna show you how I make my fresh rosemary. So the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna be doing this in two phases. I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna use my fresh rosemary to make a spritz for my hair and my daughters as well for extreme hair growth, okay? So come on over, I'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do next. Now guys, so I have my pot here and I'm gonna be pouring in two cups of water. Now, one of the reasons why I love using rosemary for hair growth is because it is so packed with nutrients and compounds that promote hair growth and it does enhance our hair health. You know, rosemary reduces hair loss. Believe it or not, if you're struggling with hair loss or if you have excessive shedding, rosemary is gonna be an amazing solution whether you use the rosemary oil or you're using the rosemary rinse or water by itself. Rosemary is gonna give you amazing results. It has amazing antimicrobial and anti-inflammatory properties and it also helps to soothe the scalp and reduce dandruff and prevent you know conditions that lead to hair loss and so when you use rosemary what it's going to do it's going to stimulate those follicles one of the things that i love about rosemary is that it does an amazing job by stimulating our hair follicles and it does that by increasing the blood circulation in the scalp 
And you know, when it does that, it delivers vital nutrients and, and oxygen to the hair follicles. Rosemary also improves our hair texture. If you want smooth and soft and manageable hair, rosemary oil and rosemary water is going to give you that moisturizing properties that hydrate the hair and it reduces dryness and frizz. You know, when you use rosemary, it also strengthens the hair and it improves our overall health of our hair. Rosemary contains amazing antioxidants that combat free radicals, protecting your hair from damage caused by environmental factors. And it also nourishes our hair follicles, making the hair strands stronger and a lot more resilient. Now that we have our rosemary broken up a little bit, you know, increasing the surface area a little bit, we're gonna add two cups of water. Now, the reason why I'm adding two cups of water, I want this to slowly cook on the stove top. Okay, so I want it to become a little concentrated so that, you know, I can, you know, benefit from this amazing herb that we are preparing today. And so that's one of the reasons why I'm using two cups of water. I want to make sure that we have enough liquid. You know, part of the liquid is going to be evaporated, but we want to make sure that we have sufficient liquid to cook the rosemary, but also we want to make sure that we have enough at the end of the process so that we can have that to last us a little while. Now, as you can see, our rosemary spritz or water, it's just about starting to boil a little bit. And once it starts boiling, I'm also going to be turning this heat down to low flame because we want to make sure that the rosemary infuses it into the water. That's the goal here. So we, we are not interested in you know, turning up the flame to burn our rosemary here or to have our rosemary water evaporate so fast that we don't have sufficient water. Once the pots start boiling, I'm going to turn down the heat so that the rosemary water or spritz will have a chance to you know get its time take its time to infuse into the water um but because it's on low heat i don't have to worry too much about it so i'm going to keep this on for approximately 30 minutes and once it's on for 30 minutes i'm going to turn off the flame and i'm going to let it cool and then i'm going to show you how i bottle it and also how i apply it to my hair and also my daughter's hair here we go guys guys now you can take a look at the water and see that the rosemary was completely infused into the water you can see that the color has been changed okay and this is going to be our rosemary water or rosemary spritz for hair growth but i have one secret that i'm going to add it to it guys and so what's going to happen is and as you know our rosemary water was you know allow it to sit you can let it sit for a couple hours or you can let it sit overnight the longer it stays in the water the more it's the rosemary is infused into the water but i have one secret guys and that's going to be cloves okay i'm sure you hear the amazing things about cloves and another reason why i love to use clove is that it, it has a high concentration of eugenol and it's a compound that promotes the blood circulation to the scalp what it does it increases the blood flow to our hair follicles and it stimulates those activities and promotes a healthy hair growth. Cloves also has amazing antibacterial and antifungal properties. So if you are a person who have a lot of dandruffs in your hair, this particular ingredient will go a long way in keeping your hair and your scalp free from infection. It also creates a healthy environment. And as you know, if you have a healthy hair scalp, that's what's gonna promote hair growth. Cloves also nourishes the hair scalp. It is rich in essential nutrients such as vitamin C and K, and it has minerals such as manganese, magnesium, and antioxidants. And these nutrients really just go a long way in nourishing our hair and our hair follicles. Another thing that clove does is that it reduces hair loss. The stimulating properties of clove combined with its ability to strengthen the hair you know, it, that's what's going to reduce hair loss. And so it promotes a healthy hair growth at, by minimizing breakage. And it also contributes to maintaining a fuller head of hair. So if you're a person struggling with thin hair and you want to make sure that you, you know, get that thickened hair. If you want thicker hair, this is the best way to do it. Combine 
rosemary water and add a little bit of cloves to it this is what's going to give you amazing results guys and what cloves together with the rosemary water is also going to add that extra shine and luster to your hair you know cloves also give that natural shine to your hair making your hair healthy and vibrant and work together to even give you a more vibrant shine to your hair they're both going to work together to condition your hair scalp and give you that soothing property it's going to alleviate any scalp conditions such as itchiness and dandruff these two together these two herbs together are going to work together to reduce inflammation and balances the scalp ph level and so that is exactly how you're going to get massive hair growth this is our rosemary growth water with cloves in it hi guys so i wanted to show you the length of my daughter's natural hair as you can see um it's approximately just below her bra strap uh, maybe you can see hopefully you can see it's just below her bra strap and i'm going to show you what we have been doing to grow her hair actually this uh grow, rapid growth has occurred not too long ago it only took a few months for her to grow her hair this length and i'm going to share with you exactly what we have been doing to ensure the thickness of her hair as well as the rapid growth that she's experienced over the last few months okay so here we go now i've showed you how to make your rosemary oil with the cloves and this is going to go a long way with strengthening the follicles the hair follicles and also it's also going to work towards increasing the thickness and the texture of her hair and so this is what we have been doing to encourage not just our hair growth but also the thickness of her hair okay and so basically what we what we have been doing is basically you know just part her hair and just spritz it so this is the rosemary water and the clove together now once the rosemary water and the clove sits for any period of time you will notice that the, the color of the the spritz itself or the water the rosemary water has changed a little bit so once it sits a little bit for a few hours or overnight then the clove will start to be infused into the rosemary water and so this is why the water color has changed now all i do is so or she does all she does is just spritz her here not to make it wet but just to moisturize it because what this this provides a lot of nourishment guys and what it's going to do is going to strengthen the strands of our hair and also we want to make sure that you get the, the scalp of the hair as well okay and you can just you can do this on a daily basis if you want and so what she does once she has spritz her hair the next thing she does is to just massage it just massage it and you can do this for approximately five minutes, three to five minutes. And if you do this on a regular basis, what it's going to happen is that it's going to encourage circulation to the hair follicles. And that is where you're going to get that rapid hair growth. Because we're using these amazing ingredients that goes a long way with strengthening the hair strands. And also, it gives you healthy scalp. And once your scalp is healthy, then that's what's going to encourage amazing, rapid and massive hair growth. The next thing that which she does on a regular basis, times up to three to four times a week, she moisturizes our hair scalp with the rosemary oil. And she just put a little bit. And also, you also have to put some at the end. Just to ensure, not too much, but just to make sure that those ends stay moisturized. Most of the breakage that we have on our regular basis comes from the end of the hair. Okay, this is the oldest part of your hair, and so you have to make sure that it's properly moisturized on a daily basis. You not only want to encourage new growth in your hair, but you also want to ensure that you're retaining your hair growth. Okay, and so this is how uh, my daughter, this is my 15-year-old daughter, and this is how she takes care of her hair. We use the rosemary water infused with clove, and we also use the rosemary oil. Not just the thickness and texture of her hair, but also to grow her hair to this length and retain it. So as I, once again, we showed you that her hair is now um, below her bra strap. Okay, once again you can see the length of her hair is below her bra strap. Now guys, there you have it. A perfect recipe for rapid hair growth. We're gonna use your rosemary water and spritz your hair. On a, you can do it on a daily basis to just to make sure you here have a little moisture not too wet you don't want it to be too wet and also you want to use that rosemary oil 
to massage your hair scalp on a daily basis and that's how you get rapid hair growth using rosemary oil and rosemary water infused with the clove now guys if you enjoyed watching this video i want to encourage you to go ahead and like the video so that others will see it and be inspired by it and if you have not yet joined our amazing growing YouTube family, I want to encourage you to hit that subscribe button and become a part of our amazing growing YouTube family. Now, until then, I'll see you in my next video. Cheers to your great health and great looking here from Journey to Health with Seals. Bye.